Hey guys, what's up? This is Recreational420 and today we're going to check out this Pineapple Super Silver Haze by Dogstar Cannabis, I believe is what it is. Or just Dogstar. <laughs> um, anyway, so let's just hop right into the numbers. The THC is um, 20, yep, 22.5 uh, with the total stuff. Yeah, 22.6 is the number there and then I'm just gonna go ahead and pop it open. Uh, so you squeeze the sides, and there's your J. Now this looks really, really well rolled. It's an, you can typically, if they're pressed down like this, they're gonna burn pretty well. At least that's from my experience. Um, I will again remind you guys that it's best to massage the J a little bit to allow for uh, smoother airflow or more even airflow is what I should say. Um, so you massage it and then tap it down a tiny little bit, kind of like you would, you know, any old pack of cigarettes or whatever. Um, and once that's there, that's, you know, it's ready to go. You can smell a little bit of like the... Uh, A little bit of uh, the pininess from the pineapple and citrusy but you don't get a whole whole lot of smell um, but again it's wrapped in a piece of paper it's been in plastic um, so it's not going to have it's a pre-roll it, it's not supposed to have a bunch of flavor or smell to it um, but it does have a tiny little bit uh, and with that I'll be back in a couple days to let you guys know how this went Hey guys, what's up? So I went ahead and tried that pineapple so pineapple super silver haze. <laughs> and um, so the flavor was, the way I'm gonna describe it, it, it was, it wasn't really there except for, you did taste a little bit of like leafy greenness. If you've had pre-rolls before, um, it, it kind of had that like, the green like leaf texture. I, if I had to take a wild guess as to how these were made, um, I would say that they were they used bud, but maybe it, the, the bud wasn't fully trimmed, and that's what's giving um, that pronounced like leaf flavor. Because that's what it is. I say green, but it tastes like leaf. Um, and then, but I will say the high makes up for the taste really, really well. I like this a lot. Um, it was a really happy, uh, uplifting wake you up kind of high clear-headed as like anything else I've ever had and this is actually labeled a sativa um, and it didn't give me any of that like weird headiness that I tell you guys I don't like which again rare so I really really do like this um, one other thing that I am gonna point out is I did hold up <laughs> this one gram joint compared to a different one gram joint and this thing looked about half the size of it so um, at the time I didn't have a scale I don't have one yet but I am going to buy one that kind of gave me the idea um, to start weighing all of my products anything that I can I know some concentrates I'm not gonna be able to like your clears your shatters that are stuck to like glass jars stuff like that but the crumbles why anything that I can weigh I should weigh to give you guys a more just the more information you have about a you know producer processor what have you um, the better it is for you and that's what I'm here for but yeah so I would still recommend this um, like I said it's a really good uplifting high clear-headed motivating uh, sativa and if you're going for a sativa that that's what you're looking for so with that this has been recreational 420 I hope you guys enjoyed that and I'll be back again with you guys soon